Hey guys, it's Meme and my trusty sidekick. <laughs> oh, Vinny's still here. I don't know if we're really here or not, but we're going to try it. So today we are making Vinny's Mother's Mother's Day card. And you might be thinking, but she's going to see it. She won't see it. Don't worry. She only sees what we show her. If we don't show her, she won't see it, right? She'll see it tomorrow. Okay. No, not tomorrow. What day is today? Thursday. She'll see it Sunday. She'll see it Sunday. So here's what we're doing. I want to catch you up to speed with where we're supposed to be. It's doing it again. Is it doing it again? I'm going to keep going. Okay. It's doing it again. We just have to give up today. That's all there is to it. So I'm going to use the stamp set called, it's 100% doing it again. 100% doing it again, Vince. I don't know, babe. Maybe not. Okay, I'm going to use a stamp set called New Creation because I want to use these flowers right here and I want to put them in the corners of this card. And you might have seen me do something similar on the cards that I showed um, for the Stamp Club reveal. If you saw me do that, it's very similar to that that we're going to do today. So what I want to do is I want to stamp this image in the corner of this card as low down as you want to. It doesn't have to be um, super low down. I just want it to hang off the corner of the page at the top. And then also we're going to do it from the bottom. And this is the prettiest look. Look how pretty that is on the corner of the page like that. It's so pretty. I love it. Now I'm going to flip it over. And I noticed while ago I had ink on my hand and I got it on my card somewhere. So I'm trying to pay really close attention to that because I'm going to have to touch this card in a second. And I do not want ink everywhere. So now what I'm going to do is ink this top corner. And what I'm really trying to do is make sure the roses are kind of there. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So that's what we're trying to do. I love this stamp set. I think it this here is so versatile. So look, we got our stamp set done. Now listen, we got our stamped image done. So here's the, the thing about this. I used the Versa Fine Onyx Black on this. And the reason I did that is because I wanted it to be very bold because I'm going to ink over it with my um, with my pink and main tool. I love this. Oh, why did I put that up? I still need it. I'm trying so hard not to get ink in the middle of this card. I feel like I have some right there, but it's not enough for me to see, so it's probably not enough for anybody else to see. But I'm trying. So I'm going to do something else to help me out too. I'm going to pull out a post-it note and put it here so I can put my hands here and not make a mess. Okay, so if I do have ink on my hands, it'll go on the post-it note. Pretty good little tip there. Well, it's not mine. I've learned it from somebody else. So. <laughs> well, hey, you got to pass on what you learn. That's what this is all about. It's true. I'm going to use Distress Oxide Picked Raspberry. And um, hang on one second. Yeah, we're good. I'm going to use Picked Raspberry. Now, here's the thing. I want to use multiple colors. So I want this pink to come all the way up to here, like in front of the flowers. So I'm going to load this brush up. I love this brush. Matter of fact, I love it so much. I went to get myself a second one and y'all had bought them all. I can't even get one. <laughs> and they're gone for two weeks. So I'm waiting. All right. So I'm going to come back here off the edge of the page and just lightly twirl that on. It's so pretty. It just is gorgeous. And um, I'm going to keep doing that until I get the color pink I want on the page. I don't want to go all the way to the middle. I want to leave some light in the middle. I want that to feel kind of bright and lit up. So, sounds like a top tip. Not my tip. I'd have to give somebody credit. I, actually, I don't remember who taught me that. But it's not my tip. I learned it from somebody. Now, here is one problem. I need to move it because look what I'm doing. I'm creating a line. So, I need to fix that. Let's see if I can. I think I can blend it in pretty good. If I can't get it perfect, we'll get close. It won't be the end of the world. I should have paid attention to that. All right. So ink in these edges, bringing that pink in. Just like that. The pink may be enough. I may add another color, but I'm going to do pink on both sides here. So now what I can do is I can put it down here and it won't hurt anything. Ink, ink, ink. Paint, paint, paint. We placed a huge stamp set order the other day, um, like a week ago, I think. So they should be coming in pretty soon. Okay. So there's that. I want to do this again because I don't love it. Can I redo it? Is this paper? 
I'll, I'll use this for a card, but it's not what I wanted for today. But I think the stress of me having to get the thing going had me a little. It's not what I want to do. So I'm going to do it one more time. Y'all don't care, right? No, they don't care. It's more time with you. I'm just going to redo it. I want. It, I don't want the pink as far down as I went, but that's okay. I have a second one to stamp. <laughs> you think I already knew it? You know, I wonder if sometimes when you prep a second one, in case you make a mistake, you're a little more, you're a little less conscious or no, pay, you, know, you pay less attention. Because I knew I had a second one over there I could use. All right, let's try it again. I want to do it a little different. I don't want that pink as far down. So let's do that. This part hadn't really been a problem. It's just been me that has been the problem. Perfect. Okay. Let this one come down. What stamps are they looking for? This one that you're using. Is it out? Well, somebody said, when would it be back in stock? So I'm going to guess that means it's out. That's probably because, um, um, what was I trying to say? That's probably because of the video I did the other day with it. Look what I did. Well, I just got to keep going. <laughs> you got an ink dot. You got a sand eraser, don't you? I do. But I have another idea. I can get rid of it. Don't worry about that dot. I know how to get rid of it. I ain't worried about it. All right, it. let's check our hands. I'm going to wipe my hands again. Sometimes when you use the VersaFine, you have to, uh, the, the Onyx Black, you have to be careful. Because if you're like me, I tend to put my fingers in here when I'm inking. And that's where ink picks up on my hand. And that, mm. I know that's where I get it from. Because I tend to put my finger in there and put pressure on it. So I pick it up. All right, let's try it again. All right, then. Let's try again. So pink on the edges. I'm going to flip it around to this side that I did first, that I stamped first. And what's the name of that stamp set? This one is called uh, New Creation. New Creation. But I'm going to be mixing it with other stamp sets, too. This is what I want. I don't want to go too far over, too far over the flowers. I didn't like how that was looking. I want that pink edge and that kiss of pink on the corner. See that? That's what I want. Okay. I like that. I see That's what more you're saying. It. You see how I'm going? I don't want it to go so far down, so I just got a little bit crazy on that last one. I went a little too far. Let's do it again. And I was thinking about using other colors, but I really think I just want it to be pink. Your mama loves pink. Mm hmm And see how I'm trying to keep light? I want to see the corners. I want the ink on the corners like that. But I want to keep that light in there because I'll tell you what, more than a favorite color, Vince's mother's favorite thing is light. She loves some light now. <laughs> light of any kind. That's She's her nearly thing. as bad as you when it comes to light. She's worse than me with light, but that's okay. I'm bad about it. I hate when it's time to turn off the lights at the house. Vince likes to turn them off so he can watch TV because he gets a glare. I want the lights on. Tell me to stop. Say stop. Say stop. That's enough. Woman. The problem is it's fun. <laughs> oh, I know it. You love that. It's fun to do that movement and to do that blending. This is what I wanted. Let me show you the difference. This is what I did. I went way too far down. See that? This is what I wanted. Okay, there we go. Now then, what I want to do is I want to stamp like the wording here. Don't worry about this. I'm going to put a butterfly right there. Gotcha. It'll cover it up. So what I need you to decide, Vinny Boo. Ooh. Is what do you want to say to her on What sentiment? How about you? Hold, I have two. So you hold this and look. Um, my mother's card said, I'm blessed to call you mom. So you need to decide what you want. And I also have another sentiment we can use, another set we can use. The one called Flowers for Mom has a sentiment that's really pretty that your mom might like better. It says this one. It says, um, to the world you are a mom. And then on the inside it would say, but to us you are the world or to, but to me you are the world. That's another option you have here. He's looking. I don't dumb. call my, I call mama. Mama, I don't call her I got mama. mama on there. Yeah, how about that? I'm blessed to call you mama. I like that. Cool beans. Let's put it on there. That's your mama's card. Oh, I have it. <laughs> so mama, we'll start with that one. Do you call her mama? I think so. I don't think I call her mom. Say, just be like. I can't. I tried it and it just came you out mama. You tried it in your so. head? Mama. All right, so we're going to use this one that says Mama. Oh, it's pretty down here. Oh, that's going to be so pretty, babe. 
That's going to look good. I like it. You excited about it? Yeah. You excited that you're going to have a card to give her? Well, I mean, I had to give her one or I'd have had to go in the Walmart store and that ain't going to get to happen. So. It ain't happening. I'm making you a card. I know. Um, see what I mean? I just put my finger right inside there and that's where I pick up ink. I'm learning that about myself. All right. Wipe the ink off my finger. And then let's put it down here. Wouldn't she much rather have a homemade card anyway? Mm-hmm. Um, oh, it's so pretty. You want it? I'm blessed to call you. I like that. Yeah. Or you want to put, Mama, thanks for everything. Or Mama, I hope your day is lovely. Or Mama, so grateful for you. Or Mama, you're the best. Or Mama, you're my hero. Or Mama, you rock. Or Mama, you are amazing. What have I got room? To my fabulous Mama? Have I got room to put, I'm blessed to call you Mama. Yeah. And then, I hope your day is lovely or something. One we can of those put that on the things. inside. You want it on the front? I can put anything you want. We can do, where was I hope your day is lovely? Let's see what that looks like. See, we can test it by laying them. I hope your day is lovely is too long. I can mask it off and make it happen. No. Let's see. Y'all are just going to watch us do this. How about so grateful for you? Um, or love you? Or you're the best. You're my hero. Um, or for my beloved mama. Or how about I'm blessed to call you mom? Because we need something for the inside, so let's don't let's don't do all of them on the front. Okay, save some for the inside. Okay, so do I'm blessed to call you out here? Yeah. Okay. It ain't easy making a card, is it there? But it ain't easy designing one. No. <laughs> you have to think it out. All right, we're gonna do I'm blessed to call you. I like that one too. I'm blessed to call you mama. Right there. Cute. It's so cute there. Okay, now we're going to fix our boo-boos. Let's do some butterflies. Do I want to stamp the butterfly directly on it, or do I want to do, I think, maybe some dimension? Do you think dimension? Are you still deciding? Are you trying to pick what's for the inside? No, I'm trying to fix some of these that you put back on backwards. <laughs> I tend to do that. Though. I can't stand to look at it and not match. I tend to do that. Okay, let's stamp a couple of butterflies and color some. I just have this little strip laying here. Let's get some butterflies from the same stamp set. Now I feel all weirded out. Having to fix them? Yeah, like I'm, like I shouldn't have to do this. Like it should have already been done for you? No, like I shouldn't be that concerned about it. Oh, I got you. Like I might be slipping a little bit or something. <laughs> You're fine. Trust me. We understand. We get it. Like I'm getting a little OCD in my old age, maybe. Right there. And, oh, no. Oh, no. I knew I did that. Oh, no. Not the end of the world. We'll get this one. All right. So, I also want to put another one down here. Like in that little crook. Oh, there it is. <laughs> it's like I lost it. It's right there. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's stamp these guys. Put a little color on them. That'll cover our boo-boos. We got to cover our boo-boos. Um, yes, Jan. I'm sorry to say that the Stopper Topper sold out quite quickly. But, I'm happy to say... I placed an order for 500 okay? But here's the deal. So that'll last six minutes instead of three. But here's the deal. Um, she cannot get enough supplies for 500 at one time. So what we're doing is she's going to make, I want to say she can make me two or 300 right now or pretty quick. And then we're going to get the other 200 as soon as the supplies come in. But she's doing her bestest. Her bestest. What color do you want your butterflies to be? Your background's pink. You have two butterflies. That is really pretty. Can one be bright? You can do whatever colors you want now. Oh. You know me about colors. Um, can one be yellow and can one be purple? Hmm. No? You tell me what you want. It's your card. Uh, yeah, do that. That'd be fun. If it's not good, we'll change it. 
It's just I, paper. I kind of want the yellow close to the sentiment. I think the little one would be cute in yellow. It's just paper. All right, and then purple for this big guy. You want me to do purple and yellow on the big guy or just purple? Whatever you think. You're, you're again, you're much better at that choice than me. I'll do purple dots up here. We'll do a yellow body. Monarchs are multiple colors, aren't they? Horticulturalists. <laughs> I guess that's an entomologist, right? Did I get those words right? Y'all will tell me if I did or not. I don't know. Hey, I'm scared to say them because I probably won't get it right, so I'll just let it go. People that work with butterflies. That works good for me. Are they entomologists? Entomologists? I can't remember. Somebody said some light green would be pretty. Oh, green would be pretty. Green's always good because green is a neutral. These are not the ones I want. I want these. Okay, now I'm going to cut these guys out. And I'm going to do them just like I did on that card the other day where I just bubble cut them. So I'm not cutting to the edge. I'm just, I mean, I'm not cutting to their line. I'm just leaving a little bit of space around here. Now, what brand are the pencils you're using? They're the ones we carry in the store. And I don't, let me see. Stadler, I think. Why do I think it's that? Royal. Uh, Royal Langnickel. That's what they are. Royal Lane Nickel. And we carry these in the store. And I really like them. I want to get a bigger set. These are the 24, I think. I want an even bigger set than that. I enjoy them. Um, I'm going to. Does it make a difference when they're trying to submit something to the gallery? Can they use their phone or does it have to come some other way? You know. Because Marion says she's tried a couple of times. And it never will go through. She says she's using her phone. Does that make a difference? That might be a Shannon question. Shannon. Because she may have talked. Shannon, Shannon or is Amber on by chance? Amber was on earlier. That could be an Amber question. They're the ones who really work with the digital part of everything or the when the customers call in helping them with that stuff. Taylor's learning all of that. By the way, Taylor has an email address now. So if you have a product question or... Um, if you would have normally, it would, well, I guess it would just be product question. Taylor has an email address with us and it is Taylor at may may made it. So if you have any questions about product or thing, when things are going to be back in or any of that kind of stuff, you can ask Taylor because Amber doesn't really know cause she's a little out of the loop now. <laughs> um, for a little while she is. Okay. Shannon says that she will email you, Mary. And if you didn't see that, um, Terry says green is a neutral. It's kind of like gingham is a solid. Green is neutral though. Yeah. But I think all colors are neutral nowadays. Oh I no, she, that was a that. question. I'm sorry, that was a form oh. of question. Green is a neutral. Is that like gingham is a solid? No, green really is a neutral. Um, if you think about it, I want you to think about this. Well, I'm just gonna tell you something. Y'all can do what y'all want to with color. You can have any thought you want to with color. But I'm just going to tell you, there's some colors that in my mind, when I was growing up, I think I was taught this. I think I was taught that certain colors were neutral and certain colors weren't. Well, my sister-in-law, this was such an eye-opener for me. My sister-in-law bought the most beautiful red coach purse when we were on vacation one time. She and I both have a thing for designer purses, right? And you've been jealous of that purse. And I have been jealous of that red purse since she got it. But I remember when there was only one and she got it. And I remember thinking to myself, She's not going to like that purse. It's not going to match everything. I did. That's what I thought because I've been taught that my mm -hmm. whole life. She's not going to like that purse. It's not going to match everything. She's not going to get to carry it very much. She started carrying that purse, and everything she wore matched it. Everything. And I'm telling you, it is cherry red, and everything matched it. And it wasn't just because I was in love with it. I promise y'all. Let me show you what I've done. I put some foam on one side of my butterfly, but none on the body. I'm going to push the body down onto the card. And this guy's going to cover up my boo-boo. And you won't even see it anymore. So I've glued it down and I'm going to press its body down and let that glue catch. But she carried that purse and my mother and I talked about this. I said, can you believe how much she can get use out of that red purse? So I did end up getting myself a red bag. I love my red purse. But I've always told myself red, pink, purples, blues, certain colors were not, um, were not neutrals. 
But lately, and I guess it's because I'm getting older. Maybe it's because I'm getting older. I know that when my mother got older, her style kind of changed. Like, I remember she was not into glitter, not into sparkles, not into bling. And the older she got, the more she got into that. And I'm finding I'm becoming that same person. And another thing, if you have a friend like Brenda, this, this really helps you. If you're struggling with color, you need a friend who doesn't struggle with color. And Brenda does not struggle with color. She loves it and she will mix it and put it wherever she wants it. I'm doing the same thing with this butterfly. It's popped up in the back and I'm going to press it down so it'll glue the front down. But she absolutely has no fear of color. And that has helped me so much because I have always thought it is three colors, you know, two that work together, one neutral that works with all, all with other two, blah, blah, blah. But that's not the case. It's just not. It, well, maybe it's an eye thing. Maybe it's how you see it. So I fixed my boo-boo and put a couple butterflies, which I think are really, really pretty. And then I got a new stopper topper. You probably shouldn't have said you got a new one as much as everybody's whining about not getting them. I told them on the, when I revealed them, I said, I love y'all, but I took one first. <laughs> I did. I told them. Look at my new I black I shouldn't have said that. They're not whining. They just want one. They just want them. <laughs> Look. That's not a whine. One. And art glitter glue is on the way. Look. Isn't it pretty? Oh, uh, yeah. With the beautiful. cross and the black and white. I've been wanting one, so. There's some perks, right? You sh There should be some perks, yes. There's I agree perks. with that. No, I got, um, so anyway, tell me y'all's opinion. Let's talk color. Tell me what they're thinking about that. I also see that somebody said they're called Lipa, Lipa what a miss? <laughs> Lipa, oh man, let's try it again. Lepidopterist. Lepidopterist? Lepidopterist. If that reminds me. <laughs> you remember Christmas vacation, Vegas vacation, and he was Mr. What was his name? That he had the fake the fake ID and his name was like Papadopoulos. That was his name, Papadopoulos. Uh, <laughs> That's what it reminds me of. Um This subscriber said when I was young you did not use red and pink or red and orange together. And now we and do. And redheads were not supposed to wear pink. You're right. You are right. But now we do. Color rules have changed so much over the years, which I'm glad of. But I'm still a black, red, and white girl. Okay. Let me move those real quick. Okay. Well, let me put some bling. I'm going to tell y'all something. Kat, I called her Kathy in my video because she goes by Kathy on here. Is she here today, Kathy Long? Kat is what she goes by because I saw her little stamp on the back of her card. She has got me hooked using this tiny bling with this set. It's so pretty. I did it on Mama's too. Did y'all see the card I made Tuesday? Did y'all see Mama's card? I can show y'all if you haven't seen it. I got it over there to take home with me today. Um, or to take home this weekend so I can give it to Mama. I'm really excited. Should I Papa tell them? Papa Giorgio. Papa Giorgio. That's what it was. Papa from, Giorgio. From, uh, Vegas. Vacation. Yes, Papa Giorgio. Yeah. Not Papadopoulos. Where does Papadopoulos come from? That's from a show too. That's from a sitcom. Who? Where was Papadopoulos? They'll know. Y'all know everything. But isn't that guy that's on TV now, George Papadopoulos? I don't think that's so. his name. No. Stephanopoulos. Stephanopoulos. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, George. And it, like he's watching. Yeah, well, you know. But it could, it might not be Stephanopoulos, George Stephanopoulos. I think it is. Isn't he from Alabama? I don't have no hey, idea. Hey, isn't he from Alabama? No joke. I think I he is. Remember. I'm going to put a trail of these behind this butterfly as if this particular butterfly leaves bling in its wake. Mm. That's my kind of but. Could you imagine wildflowers <laughs> with butterflies leaving bling? <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> Y'all, what if we get to heaven and that's what butterflies do? Are you kidding me? That would be incredible. That brings tears to my eyes. What if butterflies did that like fairies? Because fairies, you know, they have glitter. We don't do glitter. I want Cheryl bling. said that was Seinfeld. Papadopoulos was? Wait, now I'm totally confused. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's put some more bling. When in doubt, when you don't know what's going on, just bling it. Um... What were we talking about before that? Oh, did they see my card I made my mom? Oh, it may be from Princess Diaries. Which one? Papadopoulos? Yeah. I don't remember. I don't remember. I don't remember. Okay, put a little bling on there because everything needs a little bling. Okay, they said from, uh, Angela said from, from the Friends TV, TV show at Monica and Chandler's wedding. That's probably it. 
That's probably where I'm going. Okay, Heather from. said George Papadopoulos was on Webster. That's the one I'm thinking of. That's the one, Webster. Because I thought it was an old show that I watched when I was a kid. Yes, okay. George Stephanopoulos <laughs> is the political commentary. And is he from Alabama, y'all? I think he is. I don't know. Okay, I'm not. I was gonna add white pen, but it's literally not showing up because and I didn't go. Snuffleupagus. I know Mr. Snuffleupagus. Sesame Street. Because let me tell y'all something. When I was growing up, I loved Steph- I loved Sesame Street. It was my show, but the reason was my mama said it was this. Y'all, this is one of those things you tell me not to tell people. Yeah, probably. I had imaginary friends. A lot of them. I mean, a lot of them. Like some people might think it was unhealthy, but I think it was probably the most healthy thing my brain ever did. As a kid, I needed to I needed to categorize the stuff that I can handle now, right? So I had different imaginary friends like crazy. And Big Bird having that imaginary friend was so comforting to me because people couldn't see him, you know. People couldn't see my imaginary friends either, but I knew he was there. And I love that Big Bird Are you going to tell any, same. any stories about those probably imaginary not. friends? You, you tell me not to tell stuff. And then you tell Marion me that said I Princess Diaries was... Therm, thermopolis. 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 All right, now it's your turn to pick a solid to go behind this. This is the charcoal. You want to look in this corner. Pick the solid to go behind mm-hmm. it. So there's the charcoal. All right. Um, what color would you like to see? Is there a color family you want me to lean toward? Let's look at yellow. No, not yellow. Not at all. All right, you want to look at pink because can't hurt with pink. Oh, lime green. Somebody mentioned some green earlier. You want to look at some lime? Obviously not this piece, but there's some green. No. Okay. And I love all these solids. Let's see how long it takes him because y'all know how long it takes us, right? Let's just see how long it takes him to pick his mama's color. That color that you have it on is pretty good. It's that was the one I went for first, but hold on, hold on. What's this one? No. That's a hard no. Okay. <laughs> Let's keep going. Oh, that one's not open yet. Do I love you and your mom enough to open one? Nope. Got one open. Don't have to struggle. Don't have to even think about it. Okay. Let's look at. You have a navy? This one. No, navy's not going to look right on the black. No, I like what you got it on the best. That's not bad. Nah, I like what you got it on the best. But I don't want much of that solid showing. It won't be much. Just a little bitty bit will sneak out. <laughs> Just a little bit will sneak out. Okay. Let me see. I want to make sure I cut this down right. I did. So we need our crema. Hubby can't pronounce his name, so I told him to call him Snuffle. Oh, oh, Snuffleupagus. George Snuffleupagus. <laughs> That's good. I like it. Um, who said? Is he from Alabama? Somebody look it up. I don't think anybody did. Okay. Charcoal is pretty. Go with charcoal. So did he go Amber to school? With me. Did he go to school in Birmingham? I feel like he has a connection to Birmingham. Was he a news anchor in Birmingham? I feel like he has a connection here. Somebody, um, somebody, um, what's it called? Wikipedia. It. Y'all don't want to leave long enough to Wikipedia it. Just a little bit, bit. Just a little, little bit. We'll show, is what Miss Jones said. Just a little, little bit. Okay. Yep. I like it. You want me to foam it? Foam it up, Scotty. I think you should. Yeah. You're really making great choices here, Vin. Well, you're kind of leading me to make the right choice, so I mean. You know what? Let me show you how much I love your mom. You ready? Yeah. You're using a whole piece on each side. That's some sacrificial stuff right there. I did this on my mother's, too. I sure did. I sure did. If it's good enough for my mom, it's good enough for your mom, right? Annette says, Olivia says, hi, my mom. Hi, Olivia. Give them thumbs up from Barb. <laughs> oh, Vin, that was the right choice. That charcoal is stunning. Look. Yeah, I like it. That's pretty, like it. pretty, pretty. Okay, card base. Card base, card. Oh, no, I'm out. Got to make one. I got to make one, babe. Now, what color card are you going to put it on? Um, well, I would have, you tell me. What were you going to do? Well, I feel, I don't want to, this is pretty, oh, uh, white. That's what I was going to use. Not for any reason. I can get you any color you want. I can make any color card base. 
Well, if you make any other kind of color card base, you're going to have to put another panel in the inside to write on, right? Um, I mean, yeah, but that's not the end of the world. We do that all the time. What you want? Let me see something. I may have cut this to where you won't even see the base. Let me see. Yeah, you're not going to see the base from the front. Won't matter. Because I cut it. Okay. I made it where this shows more than just a tiny little sliver. So you won't see the card base. You're just going to see that. Do you want to see the card base? No, I mean, it don't matter. I mean, I can make it not standard size. I mean, I can put it in another envelope. I can do whatever you want. Just make it normal. Okay. You won't be happy if I don't make it normal. I, I don't think you will. I think you'll like it normal. All right. Scoreboard. Scoreboard. You want to do this part? You want to? You no, wanna, you got it. You want to do something? You know, to act like you did something for your mom's part? I said George is from Massachusetts. Yeah, but he's got ties here somehow. I don't remember what they are. I don't, I really, and I could be wrong. I have been wrong before. All right, I'm flipping this guy over and scoring it on the other side too. I find, I'm finding lately, first off, I totally missed the mark there, but I'm finding lately that the Teflon, is this Teflon? Yes. yes. It makes me want to score on both sides, whereas before it didn't. I just put that up and don't need to. Why don't I need to? Well, because you got to finish it. Mm-hmm. Finish it. There we go. Don't need this no more. Oh, we got a super chat. Thank you, <gasps> Thank Laurie you. Austin. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, that's a pretty card, babe. Mm hmm She's going to like that. She is going to like it. Thank you so much. Oh, I love that orange color of that, that super chat. It's my favorite, one of my favorites. I'm really into color lately. I think y'all can tell that by my bag. I look at it and go, this is not a bag. Shannon found no Alabama connection. Y'all, I'm telling y'all. I don't maybe he's married to somebody from Birmingham. I don't know. There's some kind of connection somebody told me that. Okay, look, Christine Nimrick said his wife's family, she thinks. Look how pretty your card is, babe. Now, do you want me to put a sentiment inside or leave you room to write? We need to put some kind of sentiment in there. All right. Do you want it up high? Do you want to write up here and I just do this normal and you sign it here? No, just do it normal and then I'll leave me room to write. All right, let's talk about what sentiment you want on the inside. Let me look at something too because on my new thank you set, these have a lot of good things in it too. Like, what would I do without you um, from the bottom of my heart? Like, we could do, we could mix these if you wanted to. Mm -hmm. um, we could say thank you inside. Um, I just thought that was another, you can use this in other ways too, so. Which one did you like over there? Let me look again. Do you want me to use the world oh, please. one? Do you want me to use the world one? Do you hear me? Do you want me to use, to the, to the world you are a mom, but to me or us, you can pick which one you want, you are the world. I mean, that sounds good. It's. Or I have You Are So Very Loved. Or whatever's over there. Decisions are hard. Guess who's selling a celebrating a birthday in a couple months? <laughs> oh. July Squatty. 4th. Squatty. July 4th, my Scotty celebrates a birthday. And look how much is left, y'all. <laughs> I'll look at comments while you do that. Um, Does it need to say from your favorite son? It can say that. That'd be kind of silly since I'm the only one. Well, my dad tells me I'm, my stepdad tells me I'm his favorite daughter. I'm the only daughter. Hey, um. I like what you said a while ago. Which one? The, uh. The worldy one? Yeah. Okay. I like, I like that. The worldy one? Okay. So, then I need to and get. And this is all small print stuff, too, so I don't know if it would work anyway. Oh, it'll work. To the world you are a mom. Is mom on there? I'm going to mix that with this one. 
I'm gonna show you what I'm doing because y'all gonna wanna know. Okay, so this is our set called Flowers for Mom. And this is the one where the mom and all these flowers layer on top of each other and they're really pretty together. But I like the sentiments that come with this. But I don't want to use this huge mom. I could use the huge mom, but I'm not going to. I'm going to mix this with the small mom. You know what I'm saying on the inside? So what I may do to be safe, yes, I may stamp it on a panel and put it in anyway. So if I mess up. I could stamp it, and if I mess up, I could put a panel in it. Let's do that. Whatever you think is the safest method for Let's you. Let's do that. Let's do that. Okay. Let's do... I did not think I would pull out all my blocks today, but I am. <laughs> all right. Let's lay this guy straight. I'm going to sit these on here to hold it down in the back for me. Um... Okay. To the world you are a mom. To the world you are a. That's what we're stamping first. Gotcha. To the world you are a. Help me, Brent. Let's do mom. I'm holding my breath. That's why I'm being quiet. Yeah, you need to move that ink pad because this one. You, yeah, did you I almost, almost set your hand in it when you went to press down. Yeah, you've been getting a lot of Happy Mother's Day wishes. Thank too, y'all so way. much. I love Mother's Day. I really do. Look at that. To the world, you're our mom. But you want it? But to me, or but to us? But to me, because you're her only son. Well, you, you could do boy. for us, for but us, so because anyway. it's all. It's all right, because it's from you, really. It's cool. Because you're the only person she's really the mom to. She, you it's know. True. To the world, you are a mom, but to me, you are the. To who? You are the world so far. Don't get too excited. <laughs> so far, so good. One more stamp. Oh, wow. Read what Michelle said. I know. Isn't that pretty? Wow. Oh, I love how that turned out. I love that. You like That's it? Good. Yeah, I like it. Now I'm jealous. I haven't done the inside of Mama's card yet. Kind of I did. Let me show you. I had it over here showing Tina earlier. Have you seen it yet? No. That's Mama's. Oh, yeah, that's pretty. That's that technique that uh, the we saw. Kathy did, and I copied mm -hmm. it. Y'all, this is a pretty card. Crease that down one more time since I opened it. Look, here's my mother's. And what I was going to do is write on, the, on this side, like Kathy did on mine. And then this is Vince's. I think these are really pretty cards. I love this. Love it, babe. You did so good. Well, thank you. I'm glad my contribution was. Does this butterfly need a bling trail? I don't think so. But if you feel like it does. Ladies and gentlemen, does this butterfly need a bling trail, please? <laughs> <laughs> I think this one might need a bling trail right off the page. Oh, she's watching this on her TV. Yeah, she said we were TV stars today. Marguerite, you should make a Mother's Day card anyway and then just keep it. You know what I'm saying? Just make it anyway. I think I'll be that person. I think I'll just make my mom a card anyway and just keep it. Is that is that bad? I don't think it's bad. I think I would. I would just kind of collect them. This is the one I would have made for you this year and this year and this year. Now I'm going to cry because I think that's sweet. That I would do that for my grandmother. That's sweet. Maybe make it and then create an album to keep them in. Just, oh, that's so sweet. And then your children could have it. Psh. There it goes. Waterworks. Everyone agreed this butterfly needed a bling trail. Small bling. Bigger. By the way, there, I can't see. But it, I got tears. I got tears. Okay. I know that's not what this all says. Ooh. Did I get you two? 
No. No, my nose is itching. Well, there you go. I got to cut more blue. Not a whole lot more, just some. Okay, a bling drill here. That's a new thing, by the way. We're going to just have to have bling drills. <laughs> we always create something new on these shows, babe. Well, that's what we're here for, aren't it? Ain't it? Ain't it? Ain't it? Aren't it? Who aren't says it? aren't? Who says aren't you? Oh, that's sweet. A 55 inch star. <laughs> that's cute. Okay, so there is Vince's mother's Mother's Day card. And I think you did a great job designing it, babe. I mean, I kind of took some lead up here, but I knew I wanted to do that. I love how these flowers look. Okay, look. In Mama's Somebody said you might could put a little bit of them on the inside. Bling? Flowers. Oh, sure you could. You certainly could. Oh, Mama's, I colored every one, right? Just because I wanted to do that. But I think this is just as pretty. I think doing it with the ink blender like that, it still makes me feel like those are pink roses. Mm -hmm. Doesn't That's it? Pretty. I, like I it. love that. So our Mother's Day cards are done. <laughs> so I love it. All right, guys, that is our card after much ado today. So we're going to close this one out and come back in for the um, after show. I don't have a whole lot. I have a lot of stuff from you guys, but we don't have any new product. Um, but I do have some questions for you about a wreath kit. I need to ask you a question about that. And did somebody say do this? I didn't hear you. Okay. Yes, we are having an after show. We're going to head to it right now. So we love you guys for being here today. Thanks so much for letting us play and take our time and make Vince's mom's card. She's going to love it. And um, we will see y'all in the after show in just a moment. See Bye, guys. Ya. Bye.